Hi, I'm Bill. I live in uh, Springfield. I've been working on this project for about nine years, and I've been working on it. This is the part of the left wing. I mean, the, the right wing. It's the rear spar on the right wing. We've been working on that basically for nine years. Uh, first thing we had to do was to make all these gussets new. This is what one of the original gussets looked like. So we had to replace all of those, and that took several years to remachine all those. Uh, about one year ago, we started actually assembling this uh, spar, and now we're to the stage where we're just doing the final riveting on it. Uh, one of the major repair problems we had with this spar was the front part of it, the inboard side, this is what bolts onto the fuselage itself. And the end of this particular cord had a crack in it. So we have to repair the cord. And Boeing has a procedure that you have to go through if you have a crack in the cord down in this section. So this is the repair part that we have to make. We had to cut the cord back uh, several feet from the end and uh, so this this piece of the cord here is brand new we had to put a new cap on it rivet that on and then part of the repair procedure is to put a plug in the inside of the cord and it goes in this area and then we put the rest of the cord, the repair cord on. So that is that assembly. Then we also have to put some external plates on here to reinforce it so that the cord is the same strength as the original one was. So we have to make a repair splice plate that is like this. And then we have to drill clear through the cord and through the bottom splice plate with quarter inch holes and then we'll put bolts in there and you can see over on the other side the splice plate of repair that we made on that. So that takes uh, 64 bolts on each side to uh, get the same strength as the original cord was. So another month from now we should be able to finish up this part of the cord.